What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Kai. Welcome back to another video with your boy Kai Ray, man. Today we're back with another reaction video. Today we are reacting to 10 things Polo G can't live without GQ reaction, man. Like I say, all my reaction video, I do not fake my reactions. All my reactions are completely real. If it's fire, it's fire. If it's trash, then it's trash. Hey, let's react to Polo G. Let's get into it. Let's go. Cranberry juice. Need that. Hey, what's up, GQ? It's Polo G, and these are my essentials. This right here is my jewelry set. I got on a necklace that go with this jewelry set. Uh, this is one of my favorite ones I um, put together during my album release of Die Legend. And I got inside of, um, like I got the picture inside of the bezel of my watch, the picture of my album, my album cover, and then I got it inside of my chain, like a, it's ca this called a memory piece, but I put this whole set together during the release of my album, Die Legend. So this one of my favorite ones, cause I transitioned from yellow gold to rose gold. And I really like these pieces of jewelry. My album cover got a lot of significance behind it other than music, cause it got all of uh, my loved ones who passed away uh, on the cover, so. I end up turning it to something that I could keep with me all the time. I never really clean my jewelry like that unless I stop at stop in the store and um, they clean it for me. I gotta learn how to now during this quarantine make sure my stuff's shining right. This is called like a Gucci facts, link facts, facts, uh, facts. chain. This bell, this um, piece actually came with this chain and all together it was like $40,000. I got it from Jewelry Unlimited, Wafi in Atlanta. One of my uh, friends put me up onto him. He was telling me like, cause I always uh, shop with a jeweler in Chicago named Treasures. And um, he was telling me like, uh, this guy, he works with a lot of artists within the industry. Mainly like Atlanta artists like Lil Baby, uh, the whole QC camp. So I'm like, yeah, I'll probably start shopping with him. Yeah, I wear it when I do shows. That's like a significant piece. Letting people know who I am. Uh, this is a Patek Philippe. This is uh, about $115,000. This was like one of those watches that I feel like I made it. Like, <laughs> if I was to get one of these, so it was always one of my plans to like get one of these watches. I got the racks on me. <laughs> the racks. For another essential. I'm always gotta have a decent amount of money on me. I'm kind of overdoing it for this uh, interview. I actually probably had like $30,000 on me. But yeah, I always just have some carrying around money or something that I can just go shopping with in case my car lock up. Cause I'm with Bank of America, so my car always lock up on me. This is about uh, 20, 40, 60, okay. I got my Gucci book bag. I just got this All-Star Weekend. I was feeling like I really needed one of these traveling bags because I had like one of these, uh, a, like a regular book bag that I got from like um, Spray Ground. And I was carrying that around for like a year until I got this bag just recently. I always need to keep this on. I usually keep like my jewelry, uh, extra pack of underwear, extra pack of white t-shirts, my soap, lotion, stuff like that. So when I travel, I can get back ready and shoot out the dope for my flight. Another essential piece for me is like, I call it like a pouch, messenger bag type thing. Um, I always have this on me to go, like I keep my money in here, my wallet, cause I always lose stuff until I just recently got a wallet not too long ago. I, I remember last year I, I ran through about eight uh, state IDs. I needed to get about eight state IDs last year. So I always keep this to keep my wallet inside and basically keep up with all my stuff. This, uh, this is uh, Louis. I think this was around two thousand dollars. This is um, my PlayStation, PlayStation Four. I just switched over from Xbox to PlayStation Four last year. The Thank Xbox you, server was one really if that you good. I was fed Xbox, up. I'm like, man, I'm switch over to PS4. I don't have to know. Well, Xbox, if I land man. in a city where I'm doing a show at like ten in the morning and I don't perform till like ten at night, I need something to just pass by time. 
I usually play 2K. I've been back up on um, GTA real heavy. I play Call of Duty every here and again. I never really got into Fortnite, but I want to start trying it. This is um, a Quake um, eczema cream. I got like bad skin condition. This is um, Dove sensitive skin soap. It's like non-scented. That soap, I need a specific soap to wash up with or my skin can have a breakout. And I always gotta put this lotion on when I uh, get out the shower or my skin could uh, have a breakout. I try everything else, uh, Eucerin, everything else that you could imagine, and these was the best things that worked for me. These is my, are my headphones. I lost my beat. Like, it's crazy, because so when I, I was younger, bro, like, when I was, I like, younger, keep, like, 13, um, 14, it wasn't even too like, long ago, like, 15 years old, Like, just to get through my flights. Through like, my flights, I always got to listen to music. Like, I spend like, most of my like, flight time like, listening to unreleased music. Like, really getting the feel for it. Listening to some of my favorite music out there by certain artists that I rock with. But I always got to have probably like, Certain, like, a yeah, I'm not really a fan like, of AirPods like, because I always lose them. Like, so, like, I done spent $200 like, on here just, crazy, just to lose them. Or forget they in my ear. One fell out, one's still there. I'm losing my mind looking for the other one. I'm like really like, really unorganized most of the time. So, um, Another thing I got is my passport. I always got to have my passport. Uh, over my regular state ID or license. Um, I always keep it with me um, as a form of identification. Uh, my passport picture, cool. I don't really smile like that, so all my pictures look the same. If you can see a pretty clear picture. It look kind of distorted though, like an Android picture almost. I think the last place I went was Canada. I went to Canada for a show. Um, I had like three shows out there for a weekend. Uh, this is a mask. <laughs> right now, that's uh, very essential during this epidemic, so gotta keep a mask on me whenever I'm shooting out the door. Make sure I grab a mask and some gloves. This is like um, a Louis, uh, like a Louis mask. They made it out of like scarves, out of, out of a bunch of Louis scarves. I got this from Exclusive Game. He, he does a lot of customs for like uh, other famous rappers or artists in general. I got my... <laughs> my Ocean Spray Cran Grape. It's the best juice in the whole world. Straight drop. No, Nothing it's better. Not. Than I always need this in a studio session, chilling at the crib. Wherever I go, I make sure I stop and get something. What's crazy is I just got on it like a year ago. I mean, it's crazy. And ever since like, then, I, drink, I just I been drink cranberry juice. I usually like, don't want to mix, like mix it, like I don't want to mess like it up. Midnight like, at I got to keep it perfect, you feel me? Like, like yeah, I open the fridge and cranberry juice in there, gotta, and I just drink it. I'd be like side. so thirsty. Like, you know thanks for watching and thanks for having me, GQ. These are my essentials. The go out now, make sure to go get it. Okay. All right, you guys, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you're new to the channel, scroll down, leave a like, and subscribe if you are new to your boy Kyrie, man. I love you guys. It's your boy Kyrie. See you guys. In the next video. Peace. Nine times out of ten. I got niggas I probably never see again. Again, again. No matter the problem, I promise that we gon' win. We gon' win. First one to switch up the one you call friends. Got no friends. Nine times out of ten. Nine times out of ten. I got niggas I probably never see again.